The following video comes from a local news station in Peru that caught something pretty creepy on camera. The station had featured a news report showing footage of a small town struck by severe weather. Residents of this town were left devastated by this natural disaster, but many of them were left totally creeped out after watching this broadcast. Apparently, something strange was captured. The segment in question starts off with footage of a school playground that appears to be completely devoid of any children. Ni los juegos infantiles se salvaron de la furia de la naturaleza. Los columpios sube y baja quedaron flotando en el agua emposada. Now the reporter makes it clear that the site has been abandoned as heavy rains have flooded the area. The segment then shows more footage of other sites that have also been left behind, but one clip in particular has left many viewers feeling a bit weird. In fact, they were left feeling beyond spooked upon noticing something strange in the recording. The news reporter is visiting a section of the town known as Santo Domingo when out of nowhere, this happens. Desde el asentamiento humano Santo Domingo, Comité 6, mira la escalera, ¿cómo podría bajar aquí una persona, un anciano, los niños, cómo podrían bajar? As the camera pans over to the base of the stairs, a strange figure can be seen. It's hard to make out what exactly is being seen here, but it's clear that someone or something is there. This mysterious figure moves in such a way as though struggling to get a grip on the staircase. Residents of the town no doubt believe that this may have been the ghost of a victim who was claimed by this natural disaster, but it's still a mystery as to who or even what this might have been. Now it's worth noting that the reporter didn't notice the figure while filming, which has led viewers to believe that something supernatural was captured. But as always, you be the judge. Did something paranormal appear? Or was something else captured? There is a store in Brazil that is well known for selling electronics and other consumer products for low prices. But aside from being known for its competitive deals, the store is known for being haunted. Now, even though there's been a couple of stories from employees who've seen strange things at work, only one video has caught footage of something pretty baffling. The video starts off with employees of the store looking over at security footage from last night. But as they continue to watch, something happens that spooks them out of their minds. Take a look. Vai no cantinho, vai no cantinho. Vai no cantinho. Ó. Tá vendo? Jesus da glória é uma pessoa com manto. A mysterious figure appears out of nowhere and makes its way across the store. It appears to be cloaked in a white garment as it seemingly floats above ground. According to one of the workers, it doesn't appear to have feet, which viewers believe is enough evidence to prove this as being supernatural. Given its oddly stiff composure, viewers are further convinced that this was something otherworldly. So then, was a ghost caught on camera? Or had something else appeared on tape? On March 23rd of 2023, somewhere in Oregon, a motorcyclist was recording footage of an off-road trail when something completely unexpected had occurred. This motorcyclist, whose name is Eden, has been here before, but for some reason, he seems uneasy this time around. He can't shake the feeling that something is very different about this path. Now, it wasn't until traveling further up that something pretty creepy was captured. Take a look. This 
is where most people would turn around. If you turn around and you never get to see what's on the other side, that's where all the gold is waiting over there. Could be missing out what's on the other side. The sound of someone or something approaching Eden can be heard close by, although it could be that a bobcat was heading towards Eden, as the pile of animal bones seemed to suggest that this was its lair, he couldn't help but think that something else was nearby. Fearing for his safety, he promptly turns around and heads home. Now it wasn't until months later that Eden had returned to the spot, but unlike before, something happens that terrifies him to his core. Watch. Bones are still here. I don't like this at all. Oh god, there's even more bones than last time. It's been a few months since I filmed the last video. Because honestly, I've just been too scared to come up here. Definitely a lot more overgrown than last time. I'm hoping that since it's been such a long time that I don't think anything will happen this time. I think that tree is actually gone. This road's been cleared. Looks like we've already passed it a while ago, but that tree is gone. dark as hell in here. I'm probably going to turn around soon. Oh, there's two ways. Holy crap, dude. This trail going on forever. It just got really quiet really fast. something straight out of a horror movie, the woods all of a sudden go quiet. But during this unusual silence, Eden sees what looks to be a tall, pale-looking figure emerging from the bushes. Upon looking closely, it appears to be crouching and walking slowly as though stalking its prey. Terrified beyond belief, Eden starts the bike while trying to catch his breath. But to make things even more tense, the bike doesn't start. Eventually it does, at which point Eden speeds away for the sake of his life. He has no idea as to what this might have been, but some viewers believe that this might have been a skinwalker or some sort of supernatural entity. But of course, what are your thoughts? To this day, this video serves to remind him that some places aren't worth further exploring. In the following video, a woman is lying in bed when she points her finger to the ceiling. Although the person who's with her has no idea as to what she's seeing, it's what happens next that leaves them pretty spooked. Now the person who's recording her is her daughter, and the reason she took this video is because as of recent, her mother has been acting strange. Erica Ponce, the daughter recording this, states that her mother has always been a sensible and healthy woman. To her, she's more than just a parent, but a friend as well. And just like friends, they would often go out and spend time with each other. From having mother-daughter dates at their favorite baseball stadium, to shopping at the fanciest mall in town on a very low budget, Erica can't imagine a world without her mother. But unfortunately, one day, something pretty devastating had occurred. Erica's mom was diagnosed with a terminal illness. According to the doctor, her days were numbered. Her life is expected to end soon. Over time, the mother-daughter dates had become less frequent before eventually stopping completely. Erica's mom was too sick to go out. Understandably, seeing her mom like this was too much for Erica. Hey, good morning. Um, I had um, a really, really bad week. Now, as time went on, Erica noticed that her mom has been acting slightly off. She's been saying and seeing things that don't make sense. 
One day, she grabs her phone to record this strange, common occurrence, but unlike previous incidents, this one has left her speechless. Take a look. See what you see. Angels. And where are they at? Uh, the ceiling. The ceiling? I don't see anything, Mom. I don't see anything. You see them? Are they making you happy? Yes. Yeah? Well, that's good. How many? Four. 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 Four? Four? Um. Erica's mom seems to be seeing something on the ceiling. She believes that her mother had actually seen something, angels in this case, as she was expected to pass away soon. Viewers can't help but think the same, as they too have witnessed loved ones say the same thing before dying. According to them, some people will see a deceased relative or friend whose purpose is to make them feel comfortable before crossing over to the other side. Now whether or not that's true is up to you to decide, but knowing this brings Erica comfort as her mother had recently passed away. Watching this video reassures her that somewhere beyond this realm, her mother is in good hands. But as always, what do you think? Like all videos, you be the judge on whether or not something was present during this recording. It's late at night when a man who's by himself enters an abandoned house. He walks carefully around the place as though acting with caution this house, according to him, has a very strange history. Now the district where the house is located has prohibited anyone from entering the place, and for good reason. There's something about this house that isn't right. Neighbors say that an old man used to live here before eventually passing away from old age. What's strange about this though is that nobody else was living with him. This giant building with lots of rooms and cryptic artifacts belonged to one single man who lived all alone. But strangest of all are the events that took place after his passing. Nearby residents have seen shadowy figures standing near the windows of the second floor and the sound of children laughing during the nighttime. Knowing this, the man treads carefully as he expects someone or something to appear. He walks around when only moments later this happens. Out of nowhere, 
a small golden statue seemingly falls over. The man pauses for a moment as he tries to understand how this happened. He looks around the space for anything that could possibly explain this, but finds nothing. Somehow, the statue fell on its own. Although pretty creepy, it's what happens next that leaves them shaken up. He continues to explore the house by heading upstairs. He sets up a second camera to record the entire floor from a different point of view when this is captured. In just a couple of frames, a small silhouette can be seen standing against the wall. It wasn't until later that the man had noticed this, but had he seen this during his tour of the stairs, viewers no doubt believe he would have hightailed out of there. Whatever this might have been definitely spooked him after watching the footage, but it's what happens next that forces him to leave at once. The man explores the second floor when he finds a couple of rooms that are mysteriously locked. Something about this does not seem right. This is what he caught. As if seeing the door open on its own wasn't creepy enough, this happens. The door immediately closes as soon as the man walks in, as though someone had slammed it shut. The man quickly rushes over to the door, but realizes that it's locked. But then somehow, the door suddenly becomes unlocked, at which point he bolts out of there. He runs out as quickly as possible, but fails to record the rest as the camera had stopped recording. However, it's right before then that something downright chilling was captured. As the camera pans over to the room that he just came out of, a dark figure can be seen inside. It seemingly stands there as though observing the man run away. Knowing that whatever this was was most likely with him inside the room has left him extremely unsettled. Not much else is known about what happened later, 
but it seems pretty clear that this man won't be coming back anytime soon. So then, just what exactly had occurred that night? Until more footage is posted, this mysterious incident remains unsolved. For more info on this story, you can check out the YouTube channel Fourth Wall, where the full video can be found. On October 25th of 2022, a paramedic posted a video of something freaky that occurred during his lunch break. The video is pretty short, so not much happens, but it's a certain detail caught in this footage that makes it quite disturbing. The video begins with the paramedic filming inside a hospital where a couple of surgeons are getting ready to transfer a very sick patient to a different wing. The paramedic walks out of the hospital to record them coming through. It isn't until later that the doctors arrive with the sick patient who according to them passed away only hours later. The paramedic then stops recording. Now, it was only after finishing work that the paramedic had watched this video and noticed something strange about it. Looking back at the footage, they noticed that during the time they were waiting outside for the doctors to arrive, something unusual was caught in the background. Take a look. If you look closely at the hallway inside the hospital, a dark, shadow-like figure can be seen standing at the end of the hall. It's there for just a few seconds before suddenly disappearing from sight. The paramedic has no idea as to who or even what this might have been, but judging by its appearance, viewers believe that an entity of some sort was seen. They further add that this entity might have been death itself, considering that the patient in this video passed away that same day yet it's still not sure as to what was captured. But one thing that's certain is that whoever or whatever this was didn't seem to belong in this hospital. It remains unknown as to who or what was caught on camera. If you caught something creepy on camera, or if there's any ghost videos you'd like me to check out and include in the next compilation, you can send them over to scaryvideos444 at gmail.com. That being said, let's get back to the video. As with most videos involving baby monitors that capture something unexplainable on camera, this next one shows something highly unusual. Joanna Pasco posted the following video after noticing something peculiar inside her daughter's bedroom. Her daughter, named Evelyn, is Joanna's first child who was fortunately born without birth defects. Before Evelyn, she was pregnant twice, but tragically, she had lost both pregnancies from having two miscarriages. Ever since experiencing this traumatic event, Joanna has been very caring towards Evelyn. She would constantly look over at the baby monitor to see what she was up to. But one day, she had looked over and saw the strangest thing. While checking on Evelyn, she sees this. Okay, 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 that's not possible. What the f is that? What is that? What is it? Look at the way, look, it's lingering. Is it the light outside? Like... The, there's no pinhole empty, like... The curtains, I pulled the curtains closed. And it's not leaving. It's getting near her. Oh my god. Did she just... Did she just touch it? Where did it go? A small ball of light can be seen floating around Evelyn's crib. It seems to follow wherever she goes and doesn't seem to go anywhere else beyond the crib. Even stranger is that Evelyn appears to see the ball of light and even chase it. It's as though whatever this is, is interacting with Joanna's daughter. Among many things, viewers believe this may have been one of the spirits of Joanna's unborn children playing with Evelyn. Others think this might have been a guardian angel or an entity of some kind. Regardless of what this might have been, Joanna feels comforted by this mysterious presence. To her, it's as though something else is looking over Evelyn. Given how much she cares for her daughter, she doesn't mind having something else look after her child.
This next video was recorded by two friends who caught something very strange while taking a walk through a secluded forest. Both friends were shooting a video for a small project, but little did they know that the spot they were shooting at had a chilling history. The story goes that a few years ago, a boyfriend and girlfriend were camping somewhere deep inside this forest where nobody could see them. The reason for choosing this spot was so that no one would catch them doing drugs. But this was a bad idea. Within just a few hours of taking a hard substance, the boyfriend suddenly falls to the ground and begins to convulse. He had taken too much and eventually passed away. Immediately, the girlfriend began to scream for help, but nobody came. Now sadly, she too had passed away, but her cause of death remains unknown. It wasn't until much later that the police arrived and found their bodies. Ever since then, the forest has been said to be haunted by the spirit of the couple. Although some believe this, the following footage has left many wondering if something haunts this place. The two friends are walking alone inside this forest when this is captured. What if I screamed to scare the demons? They would mimic your scream. Oh. That never scared me anyway. Maybe it's just a bunch of kids trying to summon demons. That in the forest we're in? Yeah. <laughs> Upon listening closely, the sound of faint screams can be heard coming from the forest. The two girls initially shrug it off as they think it might be some kids playing around in the woods. But as they continue to listen, they begin to realize that the screams are getting louder and more frequent. <laughs> the more you listen, the less scary it sounds. The more I listen, the more scary it sounds. <laughs> yeah. The screams seem to be coming from someone who needs help. However, the source of the screams can't be found. Given the history of this place, which is said to be haunted, the two girls quickly fled in a panic. It's unknown as to who was screaming, but many viewers think that calling the police would have been the right thing to do, as it could be that someone was crying for help. While some believe that this might have been the spirit of the girlfriend who passed away in this forest, others can't help but think that this was an actual person in need of help. If that's the case, then this video becomes a whole lot scary. Now the girls eventually did call the police, but the rest of the story is unknown. So then, just what exactly was going on inside this forest? As with most videos whose original source is unknown, this one remains a mystery. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Also, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe and make sure to hit the bell icon so you don't miss any uploads in the future. That being said, until next time, peace.